The weather has been quiet for the last several days and weeks, but a large storm system is organizing in the central United States, and it will bring rain and wind to the northeast United States in the days before Thanksgiving. Let's break it down. Hi, guys. I'm John with the New York Metro Weather. Long time no talk. Today's Monday, November 20th. You're looking at visible satellite imagery across the central United States, which is showing a large storm system developing and encompassing a fairly large area of the central U.S. Look at the moisture surging northward here. You can see these clouds moving uh, northward from the Gulf of Mexico. And then we have a large cloud canopy encompassing the Plain States and moving into the Ohio Valley. So this storm is going to move off to the north and east, and it's going to bring rain and wind to a large part of the country, including the northeast and the New York City metro area in a couple of days. Let's look at the simulation. Here's a European model. And what happens tonight into Tuesday morning is this storm really starts to ramp up a bit. This is valid on Tuesday morning around 8 o'clock a.m. So in the northeast, that high pressure is hanging on and keeping things relatively calm. But rain has moved into parts of the Ohio Valley and the Great Lakes during that time frame. Showers and thunderstorms moving into parts of the southeast. But eventually, as we move into Tuesday night and Wednesday morning, here comes that rain entering parts of New England. You can see that heavy rain moving into the area, and it's going to be uh, likely for several hours from later Tuesday evening into Wednesday morning. Then the system finally shifts away Wednesday into Thursday. But before it does so, there's also winds to worry about. We'll break down a little bit more about this, but here's Tuesday night. This is valid at 8 p.m. This is a, a several thousand feet above our heads, but as these winds move in, conditions could get quite gusty as this low pressure system evolves. So we have a storm coming through. Let's break down the timing and what it's going to look like as it does move through the area. So again, really the rest of today into Tuesday is fine. We'll notice some increasing clouds on Tuesday uh, as this storm system moves in. And the more aggressive model Models say that we could have showers by the early afternoon hours, maybe around noon into the early afternoon on Tuesdays when things start to go downhill. Then the storm system begins to evolve a little faster and that moisture will start to increase. This is when the winds could start getting gusty after sunset on Tuesday into Tuesday night. And those periods of steady to heavy rain throughout parts of the mid-Atlantic into New England, they'll continue all through Tuesday evening and then into the early morning hours of Wednesday. This is valid 8 o'clock Wednesday, so we still have periods of heavy rain, showers, and very gusty winds at times, especially along the coast as this storm system evolves. So if you have travel plans, second half of Tuesday, first half of Wednesday, you're going to want to check with your carrier and leave yourself some extra time if you're driving or taking the train as this system evolves. Again, it's, it's the heavy rain and wind that can cause problems, especially with air travel during this time period. The good news though is that by Wednesday afternoon, the storm starts to shift offshore. Models have a couple showers lingering, but if we move, look at the European model and track this, this is valid at 4 o'clock p.m. on Wednesday, and you can see that the system is cleared off the coast, a low pressure, well off to the north and east. So by the time we get into Wednesday and then Thursday, we'll clear out. Thanksgiving itself looks great. Blustery a bit, winds out of the northwest, keeping things a bit chilly, but the storm itself will be gone. So again, we have rain and wind to worry about. It moves in the second half of Tuesday, probably after about noon. Those showers will start streaming in from the mid-Atlantic into the northeast. We'll have a period of heavy rain and gusty winds Tuesday night into the early morning hours of Wednesday. And then by Wednesday afternoon, that storm will start to clear off to the east and we'll see improving conditions, blustery west winds, but improving conditions as we move towards Thanksgiving. We will have lots of updates on this storm system, including the potential for rain and wind in the next couple of days. Stick with us right here. If you have any questions, leave them right here in the comments, and we'll be back with another video update soon. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Talk to you soon.